Hi everybody, how's things? So this is Doctor Who Season 2, Episode uh, 9, Part 3 of the Time Meddler and this episode is called A Battle of Wits. When we last left off, the Doctor had disappeared out of his cell that the, the crazy monk guy was keeping him in. Um, and obviously Stephen and Vicky are now tr trying to figure out kind of where he is, what's gone on, what's happened. So we'll get straight on into it and we'll see where this one picks up from and let's go Mike thought he was in here too. Well, because the clothes on the bed hadn't been moved. Well, it makes sense, doesn't it? How did he get out? There's only one possible answer. What? A secret passage. A secret? Pa well, they are in a monastery. Oh, no. Listen, they always have them in castles and monasteries and things in case of siege or fire or In case something. of fire. Well, don't just sit there. Help me look. So that's where he went. Was a clever girl then. I'm actually quite interested to see how their relationship develops and you know where where's this kind of leading where's this gonna go does he not know that this door's here is he completely oblivious to us Better get out of here quickly. You know, we couldn't find the doctor at the end of this. If I know the doctor, it's not going to be as simple as that. Hey, from what you've just said, you've saved me quite a journey. Hmm. To meet your friends, you mean? Hey, indeed so. I told them quite specifically to meet me outside the charge here, yeah, the uh, prearranged uh, place. Uh... You've seen them? And, uh, and their fleet? Hmm? Oh, no, no, not a fleet. This was just a small band of men. They must have come from one ship. Yes, I see. Yes, I see. Hmm. Yeah. You speak of a fleet as though you knew it existed. What? <laughs> Did you say the monk? Yes, I did face him. I uh, realize that I've got a far shorter time than I thought I had. Yeah, I'm always leaving you in a hurry, I'm afraid. But uh, maybe it's some it. urgency. Well, won't you stay and have some uh, some venison? Oh, no, thank you, thank you indeed. It's very kind of you. I must go. Yes, goodbye. Oh, and uh, uh, don't worry, don't worry. The Vikings will land south of here. Doctor. Doctor. No, you were right, Vicky. The doctor wouldn't wait for us here. We must have gone back to the target. Yes, <laughs> She's off. <laughs> you know. Here's a couple of anodin extra. They'll do you the world of good. If they... If they were part of the main fleet. Two... Or three days from them. Thank you. Thank you, yes. Two or three days. I'm on schedule. I'm on yeah, schedule. Yeah, but schedule for what? He's very weak. Stay here. Don't worry, Father. My wife, Edith, will call regularly and attend to any additional work, and, and I will come to if, if work permits. Now, look here, my son, I... Yes, Father? I don't no, think nothing, he's got a choice. Nothing, nothing, nothing. He's going to have to let them Goodbye, keep coming, I'm or he's going to have to go and Goodbye, go somewhere myself. else. Why does that? If we put enough distance between the Saxons and ourselves, we can still complete our task. Sven, we have failed. Leave it to Ragnar. Let us think of our own safety. We were landed here for a reason. What good can the two of us do now? If we meet up with the Saxons again, they will kill us easily. And what would you have us do? He could hide. Hide what? I'm saying what we both think. Our army will still land, even if we'd all been killed back in the forest. I suppose you've already thought of a place to hide. Yes. The monastery. And ask for what? Sanctuary? They can't refuse us. Do you'd rather do battle with a band of monks? Yes, yeah, there's just, there's no band. Once inside, there's no band. Hostages. We're up to date. 
Uh, what is it? Power. What the hell? Really just to help me with that. Oh, everything's going on marvelously. What's his I plan? Was... What is his plan? How to convert this ridiculous thing into miles? Four. Third measurement miles. Where are they? Is it the Vikings or is it Stephen? Seventy three, right in the middle of your spinal cord. He's a clever sod, isn't he? Quick. I thought I'd seen the last of you, Doctor. Oh, did you now? Well, as it happens, I happen to be a very curious fellow. Yeah. But the TARDIS was down there. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, no. It would be to dematerialise. So? You'd be left. If the Doctor left here in the TARDIS, he couldn't get back. What is it? Vicky, come and take a look at this. What? Just come and look. She's quite hungry in this episode, Vicky. What do you make of that? It's a... It's a gun. Of sorts. Trained out to sea, hidden by the bushes. Look, in Saxon times, they, they use swords and Oh, my word. Is, like trying, this, is he going to use this to yes. gun down the Viking fleet? You're right. The door, I must go. I'll just need that, shall we? Mm -hmm. But if I don't go, they'll get suspicious. But then we'll both go. I'll open the door, then I can keep an eye on you. Mm -hmm. You open the door now, Doctor. That's not a very good idea. Oh, isn't it? And why not? Because you're not wearing the right sort of clothes. No! Oh. Yes, I see, I see. First you want to open the door, then you want the chance to reverse the position with the help of whoever it is outside. Wait there. And be quiet. Doctor. Suits you. What is the meaning of this, sir? What? Silence, you old fool. What? Is he going to be behind there? again he left it open we can father oh you can well not you most certainly can I'd have come here a bit later but it seems I'm going to be rather busy up at the monastery what is it you want us to do Prepare beacon fires on the cliff tops. Beacon fires. Oh, don't worry, don't worry, Walnut. I'm expecting some building materials for reconstructing the monastery. Spoke of a planned invasion. Of many hundred ships. Beacon fires. Yeah. On the cliff tops. Shit. Viking? Whoever is, he's lost an <laughs> argument with somebody. <laughs> well, that's strange. What's it doing coming out of here? A door! Uh, let me out. We can get inside. This place is full of little... What the actual fuck? It's a TARDIS. The monk's got a TARDIS. <laughs> 